Hi there, this is Kelly O'Neill. I am a profit strategist and brand marketing expert that works with entrepreneurs to help them rapidly accelerate their path, not only to profit, but also the freedom that you desire in your business. So today I'm going to teach you very quickly a concept that I developed called critical path. And critical path is the process that I take entrepreneurs through to make sure that they are building their business in the most strategic way so that they can work way smarter rather than harder. So one of the things that I wanted to let you know is when you're not operating in critical path, it's costing you a lot of time, energy, and money. I mean, many of my clients reported to me that they, you know, they wish that they had learned this years ago. Um, in fact, you know, it, I hear this all the time. I wish I'd met you 10 years ago. I would have saved myself hundreds of thousands of dollars and a lot of headaches. Or, oh my gosh, why isn't everybody teaching this? How is it that I have been to as many seminars or taken as many programs as I have, and this is the first time I've heard of this? Um, or, you know, it's, I hear often that when people are in my deeper level programs, it's, it's like I got more from talking to you in 90 minutes than I got from a two-year-long program. You're the industry's best-kept secret. And I don't know if that's necessarily a compliment or if that's, that's, that's a little bit problematic, which is why I am reaching out to teach people this very important information. So what exactly is Critical Path and why do you care? So critical path is the process that I take entrepreneurs through where they bu are building their business in a specific order. And if you think about it, we have critical path in our life every single day if you're operating strategically. And I know this is a little bit of a funny photo, but I'll explain. If, as an example, you're getting dressed. go, I hope, I don't know, maybe you would, but you would never go and put on your pants and then put your undies on top of it, right? Because obviously that is not going to work out well for you, right? You're going to leave the house. It's going to be awkward. So you would never do that. You know, another example for the ladies listening to this is you would never go uh, and do all of your hair and do all of your makeup and then jump in the shower right? Because now you've just essentially done a bunch of stuff that you're going to wash all off and then you're going to have to we're operating out of critical path. It costs us a lot of time and energy that we don't need to be wasting, right? So what exactly is, is critical path? So the critical path that I teach people, and again, I'm going to go through this very quickly in my, some of my trainings, I go very in depth on this, but I'm going to just go through this very quickly for you. At the center of critical path is always you. And the reason for that is your business can only grow to the extent that you do, which is why for entrepreneurs, you hear everyone talking rightfully so about continuing to educate yourself and growing as a leader and as a business owner. So you're always at the center of critical path. The very first thing that needs to happen, and I will also tell you this is the most skipped step in critical path, is to achieve absolute clarity. That is clarity around what, exactly what you want your life to look like, exactly what you want your business to look like, and exactly what finances you need to be working towards in order to have the business and life that you desire. Until you are clear, you cannot operate strategically because it's kind of like, you know, saying, I, I want to take a vacation and then all of a sudden you get in the car and you just start driving. If you don't know where you're going, you could spend eight months driving in the, in all over the place to then realize you actually needed to take a plane to go where you really wanted to go. So you have to have clarity. The next step is cash infusion. It takes cash to build a business. You know, this is why I created one of our products that I created around marketing to millionaires and learning how to create cash quickly. So we've got to have cash in our business. So if you're starting up your business um, or if you're in a position of wanting to expand your business, you need to make sure you have cash to do it. The next step, um, if, if clarity is the destination, strategy is the GPS. 
it is plotting out the map of exactly how you're going to get from where it is that you, where you are to that exact destination in a way that is easiest and most pleasurable for you. So being strategic about your business, making sure that you're making your competition irrelevant and that you've positioned yourself and branded yourself in a way, um, strategically speaking, that you are delivering the right messages to your clients, that you are easily set apart from them is absolutely critical. The next step from that is, and again, you can't have a strategy without clarity. You really can't develop a brand effectively without that strategy and clarity. So when I'm working on um, in my agency with branding clients, the very first two steps, that, well, actually the very first three, we always address are clarity, cash infusion if they need it, and strategy. And from there, we begin to develop the brand. So just because you have a website and a logo does not mean you have a brand. The brand is a story. It's a methodology of communicating your promise to your consumers, and it needs to be in alignment. All right, once you've got a clear brand and it's very succinct and it's very aligned, this is when we can start doing marketing, right? And we're going to pick the marketing that is going to help you get to your destination the fastest. Guess what, guys? Here's the great news. This does not mean that you need to do 92 things to market your business. In fact, I find that when people actually choose the one thing that they are the best at, that they can rapidly accelerate their business with just that one thing to really move the needle on their results. So for me, as an example, that is speaking. If I did no other marketing in my business besides speaking, I am going to have you know, a seven-figure business, right? That's how I built my seven-figure businesses, is just speaking. All right, once we've got marketing and people now, it's like they know the story we're telling, we're telling a good story, we're starting to reach out to people, people are getting introduced to us, they're excited about what we're doing, we have to go into the sales process, right? So sales comes after, after that, where we're actually you know, having a process by which we're enrolling people into the right services, the right programs, and the right uh, products. And there's ways to systemize this and to make sure you're getting your best fit clients, not only for you, but for them. Then once we have all those, those processes in place, we're going to start making sure they're all working the best they can. So rather than adding other stuff, because again, where I see people go sideways, rather than adding a bunch of other stuff, it's like, well, I don't have as many leads as I want. It's like, instead of saying, well, let's start adding in social media and this and writing a book and all of these sorts of things, the answer really is, how can we make what we're already doing way better? So again, if I'm using the example of speaking, how can I make sure I'm speaking at the right engagement? How can I speak at more engagement? It's actually op measuring and optimizing the results uh, and the, the strategies and the tactics that you're already using. Finally, once we've got a good system down, automate everything. This is your ticket to freedom. This is where we are literally putting processes and, and systems in place that work you out of having to do the day-to-day -day grind of your business. Most people are woefully unsystemized and unautomated, and that's why they get stuck where they can't get away from their business because they've not put in this critical step. And one of the things I do with my clients is as we are creating something, we're actually documenting it, creating a system around it, and creating a process around it from the very get-go to make sure they get out of the day-to-day -day operations of their business so that you can have a life, right? I mean, that's a great, great idea. I mean, we got into business for freedom, so, so you can have a life, a life. So once you've got that initial system in place, entrepreneurs, because of who we are, we like to expand. And so once we've got a good system in place and we've got that basic level of foundation in place, now it's like, what's next? Do we want to expand out and expand into more reach? Maybe you're marketing into local markets and you want to go um, statewide, or maybe you want to go national. Maybe it is you want to add a whole nother level of service offerings. What does that expansion look like? And once we kind of have an idea of how we want to expand and where we want to expand and who we need to become to expand, then we go back to 
through the critical path again. Now, here's the thing, these things don't need to take a lot of time. It's not like you need to spend two years in this first, in this first cr critical path circle before you up level. If you're doing it correctly, you can spend maybe a couple months, you know, depending on where your business is. Maybe you are, have a bunch of stuff dialed and you need to just go back and just refresh. So this is critical path, short and sweet. I've got an example of what it looks like when you're not on critical path. So I see this all the time where people have come to me and they said, I'm not getting the results that I want. And one example here, um, I had a client, we're going to call her Jen. She came to me, she'd invested in this sales program, sales scrape, right? We need sales. You saw sales on Critical Path. Uh, and it was a very good sales training program. The, the challenge was, is that Jen didn't even have clarity yet. So she spent $35,000 getting into this program and didn't have actually know what she wants to do. Is not super clear about what her, her what she wants to do as it is right now and she has no strategy nothing to sell she's $35,000 into a program and 12 months later she has zero new clients and is very frustrated and is kind of you know happy about another example we're going to call him Bob where he actually you know called me and said hey I need to, I need to do some consulting with you I need I need to get on critical path and we were in the process of doing his critical path. He went to an event. He got um, sold by someone who's saying, you know what, if you want to make a lot of cash fast, um, I am going to, um, I'm going to help you create this webinar sequence. Webinars are the way to make cash fast. And we're going to help you make a ton of money with someone. And when he can wait a minute, your business is super out of alignment, your brand's all over the place, You, this is actually not going to create a quick cash infusion, right? That's in, unless you have all the systems in place, but there are so many things wrong with this picture. You don't have a list, you have never done a webinar, you've never sold a coaching program, you don't have anyone to promote you, like this is the slowest to cash. And what ended up happening was, because he went outside of critical path, he ended up spending a ton of money, he got financially overburdened and became super, super stressed. And eight months into this process of creating this cash infusion webinar, it's not even launched yet and he doesn't have any clients from it. So that's a great, another great example of going outside of, of critical path. So the very first thing that I can suggest to you is find out where you are in critical path. And I will also tell you, it is likely not where you think it is. It is likely not where you think it is. I had a event. Um, in fact, I often have an event called Profit Transformation Life. And in that event, I had a variety of students that were, some of them were brand new starting their very first business ever. And some of them had been in business for 20 years and had, you know, multiple seven figure businesses. Every single person in that room did not have clarity. Not one person in that room had a definitive strategy. And even if they were able to get to that seven figure or multiple seven figure mark, they were so stressed out and so burdened by their business, they were ready to quit because they didn't go in this that order. They didn't go in critical path. So when they, we went back, they completely transformed their businesses. They completely transformed their businesses to be more profitable, to be more pleasurable, and to really align with the work that they're meant to be doing in the world and working in the way that they want. So what they were able to do was create a complete profit transformation that accelerated their path to the results that they desired. So if you don't know where you are in critical path, one of the things we offer is an amazing uh, profit acceleration analysis and strategic planning call. And this is a 30 minute call where one of my strategists gets on the phone with you and helps you identify where you are specifically in critical path. Um, they also help you develop a plan to kind of pivot your business to get it on the right track 
so that you have the business you want, you have the life that you want, and your business is working for you instead of you working for the business. If you'd like to take advantage of that um, session, it's a $500 session. We actually offer it to people um, free of charge so that we can help them get on the right path. You can go to kellyoneal.com and you can click on book my complimentary session. All right, guys. Thanks so much for listening to me. I'd love to hear your feedback on this. Let me know what you think. Let me know the questions you have. Uh, and until next time, this is Kelly O'Neill. Have a profitable day.